Hi, good morning and welcome to Tossing Lifestyles. Today, we're going for a brunch with my family. Being a fashion communicator, I've always experienced and played with different materials. So today, from their car decor to their space decor and food styling. Oh wait, I forgot. And their personal styling. I'm going to do everything for them. So let's not wait anymore and go. Okay, we are ready to organize our backseat organizer. Even though it's a short journey, but my family needs to be hydrated. So here's a bottle of water and fresh juice in this. Along with that, tissue papers right here to keep it clean. And nowadays we are living in the time of hygiene, so a sanitizer is a must. That's why I'm putting it right in the middle. Like this, our organizer is complete. Now moving to the entertainment aspect, I'm going to add this iPad to this attachment right over here. Now my family would definitely require some snacks. So I'm going to add these healthy granola bars under this armrest. And then to ensure they comfort fully, I'm going to add these soft matte black cushions right here. Lastly, I'm going to add some energy drinks in the dashboard. So let's get in front. We have a cooling compartment right here. That's why I'm going to add this energy drink and these wet wipes to make my family feel refreshed all the time. We're all set. Now let's go to our destination. bright sunny day. I'm going to do an outdoor setup for my family under this gorgeous marmelos tree. We have quite some greenery around here so why not add some floral decorative items with minimal furniture. So what are we waiting for? Let's go. Beginning with this minimal furniture, I've used these black sleek chairs and this marble tabletop. But life is not always black and white. That's why I've added these warm and cold tones right here in these flowers. And these scented candles right here. Because you never know if your brunch extends to your dinner if you're having so much fun. Coming to this side, this is a more of a cuter and smaller side with this small table. This beautiful golden lamp. And my favorite and the cutest, this cute golden fan right next to this pot. I don't want my family to spend time on their phone so much. That's why I've added this caravan with this small flask next to it. So that we could listen to music, chill a little bit and yeah, have fun. Next is my favorite section, which are these small birdhouse looking candle lamps hanging right next to the setup, which will give a nice and cozy vibe to it. Last but not the least, these huge potted plants around it to give like warm hugs to my setup and family so that we could spend an amazing time. There's no brunch without food, right? So let's get started. Now we've reached the best part of our plan, food. And here I have with me my sister Shreya. She's going to help me out in plating these amazing platters from savory to sweet. Let's begin with our savory platter. I'm going to balance out the texture between crunchy and soft. For that, I have garlic loaf, green focaccia and some flaxseed lavash with crackers and nachos. Let's begin up with slicing this garlic loaf. I really like the taste of garlic which adds a little tinge on this platter. I'm going to slice them up into thin pieces. Now to add some greens to the platter, I'm going to chop them and chop this focaccia into triangular pieces. Display it in a raw form. Now to add 
the crunchy part, I'm going to add this lavash right next to this plate. And add these crackers right next to this focaccia. Now to add this light nutty and cheesy aspect, we have these hard cheese cutouts to balance the texture on this platter. Now one of my favourite parts is nachos because it is a little spicy and salty which is a perfect balance on this platter. Now let's finish off this platter with some cherry tomatoes and salsa. And we are done with this platter. Now moving on to the fruit platter for some refreshing vibe. I have some freshly cut musk melons right here in moon shape which I feel the easiest to use. Now to add some colour to this green melon, we are going to add circular form oranges with some fresh cut pineapples. Because it's summer, it's my favourite season, especially for mangoes. Here I have this flower cut mangoes which I'm going to add right in the middle of this plate. Now after these mangoes, I'm going to add these juicy grapes right next to it. Now that we have all the colours on the plate, why not finish it up with some yellows and reds. Therefore I have these triangular cut watermelons and these date fruits right next to it. Now that we're done with this, moving on to my favourite platter, the sweet platter. I do have a sweet tooth, I admit. So let's begin with my favourite, some chocolate muffins with some vanilla almond muffins. Let's gather them all together. This is already making me hungry. Next to these muffins, I'm going to add some fruit cake. Because it's all about balancing, I can't forget the crunchy aspect. So I have some mini cream rolls here. Sweet tooth doesn't mean that I always need to have something slightly unhealthy. Therefore, I have this mango, blueberry and raspberry yogurt next to this plateau. some flax seeds to it to give that nuttiness and that crunchiness to this platter. Some almonds on the side. Oh, we're done. Not completely though. Just to add some honey on the side to drizzle and some fresh mixed fruit juice. Fashion is connected. Therefore, I'm wearing this white cotton dress that blends with this nature-loving outdoor setup as well as these gorgeous, vibrant food platters. I feel like drinking it right now. Cheers! Now we're finally done. Only one thing is left. I need to change into my other outfit and call all my family members. So let's go! I guess we're running a little late. Can't wait to see the reactions.
Therefore, I made sure all of us are wearing florals, airy, comfortable clothing, yet stylish.